Greetings brothers and sisters, it's Teela here with Children of the Serpent. Welcome to another video. Today um, we are going to do another video of a personality type. This is the second one. I'm going to try to push these all in one night or within two days. We'll see how this plays out and if I can somehow push my videos faster and research faster. Let's see what I can do one night. Um, but I do work in the morning, so can only push so far. <laughs> if you didn't watch the previous video, just a quick catch up. We are doing a series of videos based off the 16 personality types that is given through the Meyer Briggs type indicator based off the theory that was proposed by Carl Jung known as the conceptual which is the different varieties of personalities and pretty much how that affects other people around them, the way we think, the way blah blah blah, all that great stuff. So moving on forward, I did change the background um, because I have to have my laptop on a charger, so sorry for the boring background, but we do what we got to do. All right, we are on the INTPs, the thinkers. We need them. This personality type is responsible for so many scientific discoveries. We, we honestly wouldn't be where we're at today if it wasn't for these individuals. Um, they are very rare, only making up 3% of the world population, and they want it to be that way. They, they like being unique individuals and being separate from entire society or what's considered the norm. However, that doesn't make them feel superior by no means. They're actually very humble individuals. and. The cool thing about them is they don't see themselves as leaders or followers, but they don't need to fit into the social norms, um, and they don't really like to follow the rules. So I really love these individuals. I think they're very fascinating. They absorb information internally, um, and they theorize, and they're very logical. Like the way they break things down into their brain is like putting a bunch of ideas and organizing it throughout internally. Um, they are usually associated with the mental or disability, I guess, at this point, it is ADD or ADHD, which really isn't surprising because if you watch um, the Big Bang Theory and how kind of his mind works, uh, you can probably see that come through a little bit. I'm not saying that's what his personality type is, it's just for some reason I think of Sheldon when I think of these people, except he's more social. Um, because they're not really that social except they can be on terms if you talk about things that they want to engage in um, and then they're more than happy to share knowledge with you, information. Um, let me see here, Doo -doo -doo. I wrote some things down. Um, they are very eclectic so as an occultist they are like literally made to help us open our minds. So I always promote having a collective mindset, but even I find myself being close off to certain ideas or subjects. But they they just they just take literally from everything um, and they put it together. They're really big into comparing different theories and meshing it all together. So these people, the way their minds work, they really could offer something unique to our community and really keep pushing us forward on our evolution as a whole and their personal um, evolution as well. Um, they are actually very nice, very imaginative, and apparently have a sense of humor. Um, they have a strong witty wit about them. Um, let me see here. I think that's pretty much what I got here. Wow, I made a wrote like an entire piece of paper, and somehow I don't have much here. Huh. I don't know how that worked. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and see you on the next one. Much love. Hell Satan.